knowledge under Islam is haram. <laughs> Brothers, sisters and friends, I hope what I'm going to say now is not taking out of my time because I follow an ethical tradition and that ethical tradition is, is when you intellectually engage with others, you can't lie. So I'm very close to walking out, but I'm not because I want to respect all of you. If I want to ask Mr. Perkins a question, you said knowledge is haram in Islam, I want you to give me the proof. Well, I... You said knowledge is haram, forbidden in Islam. I want textual proof from the Quran or the Sunnah, the prophetic traditions. If you don't do that, either admit you're lying or you're misinformed. You're a doctor, you're an academic, to come here, to come here, all types, all types of knowledge, to come here and to actually spew lies is unethical, it's demeaning, it's disrespectful, and it just shows bad on the atheist tradition. Okay. So please give me evidence why knowledge is haram in the Islamic tradition. What I said was... You said knowledge was haram? <laughs> yes. <laughs> And if you're wrong, I want an apology. <laughs> it is very friendly. I'm just trying to teach people manners. <laughs> what, Sir, I, what I was um, referring to... Um, yes, sir, please. What I was referring to yes, sir. were the the teachings of Al Ghazali. And he said no, it was haram. Uh, what he said was that reason and I read a book by Al Ghazali. Okay, what well, what I said that he said was okay. reason and rationality are useless and should be condemned. Okay, now if I have misinterpreted the word haram. Perhaps I am incorrect in that. But okay. what I meant by yes. that yes. was just what I said here. That reason and rationality is condemned in Islam. That's what I meant. By okay, that. that's I'm a lie. Well, I'm, that is what... <laughs> Have you read the works of Ali Ghazali? Name me one book he wrote. Just one. One book. I believe he wrote The Incoherence of the Prophets. No, it's called the incoherence of the philosophers. Philosophers, sorry. <laughs> this is exactly my point. I'm going to start my presentation. Thank you.